wanted to make a video on a subject matter that I've been interested in quite a while. And it's really about people who have or, or don't, don't have a sense of helpfulness. You go over to the reception desk and you ask them a question and they don't really want to be bothered with you. And usually uh, you have to catch their attention or they, they pretend they don't see you. Or you go someplace and, and uh, you go over and you, want, you need some help with something and the person works there. And you can see that they don't really want to help you. They don't want to go through any trouble. They, they don't want to be bothered. And uh, I find that you can't continue with somebody like this. Um, it's kind of like pushing a, a dead horse around a track. Uh, they, they try to make you work. You should do this. You should do that. You should go there. You should go. anything so they don't have to do anything. They, they do this in a pretense, like they're trying to help you. But what they're really trying to do is give you the, what I call the bum's rush. Uh, there's so many people disengaged in what they're doing. They're not into their job or not helping someone. I, I went to a, a, a local supermarket where they have like a buffeteria, cafeteria type of thing. And uh, they, they have pizzas and you can get a hamburger or fries or a coffee or soda or whatever. And I went to the back over there with three workers and they're pretending they don't see me. And finally I get somebody's attention. Could somebody make me some French fries? And the guy says, okay. And uh, I walked around, sat in the cafeteria. I said, I'll, I told him I'll be in the cafeteria. And all of a sudden, about 10 minutes goes by, I go up to the front to the cashier where the cashier is, it's a young guy. And I said, you know, I've been waiting for French fries. And he said, oh, they've been sitting here. I said, you mean they've been sitting here all this time? And the, the French fries were cold. And, and, he, and he said, oh, I didn't know they were for you. I said, well, you're the cashier for the cafeteria. Don't you turn around and see if anybody's in the cafeteria, if somebody brings you hot, hot food from the cooking area. And, and that's typically uh, uh, what, what you find today is that people are in, are disengaged in what they're doing, and they have no sense of helpfulness. If you went over them for something, they, they don't really want to help you. They want to, their whole outlook is they're going to send you somewhere else or get you get rid of you real quick. And you know, what I call, again, the bum's rush. I, I went, went to a, a medical appointment locally, and I gave them my insurance card and, and so forth and so on. And later on, I received a bill that indicated that I didn't have insurance. So I went back there and I, I said, I received this bill. And the person says, I'm not the billing department. You got to go to the billing department. I said, well, somebody didn't enter my insurance in this place. And that's why I got the bill. Oh, nothing I could do about it. I said, well, do you have an office manager here? So all of a sudden they take out a paper to start to do something, hesitatingly. And, and this is what I find all over the place. And, and now it's been a few days they were supposed to call me. They're not gonna, they haven't called me. Well, I'll be going back there, so I'll take care of it. But the point is, uh, there's no point if you go someplace and you're trying to get somebody to do something for you. Don't push a dead horse around a track. Go and speak to another employee, and hopefully there'll be somebody that will be engaged in what they're doing, and they'll have what I call a sense of helpfulness. And if you don't, if you don't find anybody that, with that sense of helpfulness, maybe then it's time to move on.